hello, how are you? I am back again and today I want to do a really quick video on how to create a rainbow bookshelf. Now, I had seen this trend on Instagram and on Pinterest and I thought it was so cute. Like, it's so cute, it's so fun, it's so cute. And I was like, I would love to do that. But the thing is, I thought I needed a lot more books than I have. I don't know where half my books are. I think I lost them in the move. So I don't have a huge amount of books. Also, I thought people would laugh at me. And also, I thought it would take a really long time, not only to display the books like that, but also to find my books. So today I'm gonna have a chat through how to do it, how to do it easily, how to do it quickly, how to make the best visual impact, and also how it makes you feel really good inside. So first of all, let's tackle that one. So I feel happiest when my home is neat and organized, which is very rare, but you know, whatever. So I feel really happy when my home is colorful and organized and happy. And what's happier than a rainbow? Nothing, there is nothing happier than a rainbow. Maybe a dog, maybe a rainbow dog. <laughs> Anyway, so I decided I would do it. It didn't take very long at all. I was shocked at how quick it was. I only really have one major display of books and I'd already tampered with the idea of putting my books into kind of color coded orders. Like in my kitchen, I've got all black books. In my office, I've got a shelf of pink books. In my Airbnb, I have all pink and white books. So I kind of dabbled in it before, but I hadn't really gone full rainbow. So, first of all, you don't need many books. You don't need a wall of them. You don't need a whole shelf of them. You just need one shelf. Like, that's all. You don't need a big pile of them. You just need one little shelf. Also, you might think you don't have many colored books, but actually, you probably do. You'd be surprised how many of your books are really colorful. Plus, with my clever little technique, you can actually make more of a rainbow than you actually think. First of all, my best tip is to put all the white books on the left and all the black books on the right. And then you have your rainbow in the middle where your eye is visually drawn to them. So you might only have this much rainbow and that many books. And if all your rainbow books are in the middle, that is what you're gonna see. So you put all your white books here and then you do pink, red, orange, yellow, green, blue, purple, and black. So you'll have quite a lot of black books, quite a lot of white books, and then your rainbow will be in the middle where everybody, including you, can see it all the time. Also, what I did to add a little extra pop is I added in all my notebooks. A lot of notebooks are quite bright and colorful, so I added all of those in and that added in a little pop of orange, a little pop of yellow, a little pop of purple, and that was great, that was really, really helpful. Also, if you don't have actually enough books in any color, you can just go to the local charity shop and probably pick up a couple of books in the right color spine for like 10, 20, 50p each, which is totally worth it. So the thing I mostly love about my rainbow bookshelves is actually makes my shelves look neater. I didn't expect this to happen. I didn't think having a big rainbow on my shelves would make it look neater, but actually normally when you look at bookshelves, they're quite cluttered and jumbled with different sizes and thicknesses and colors going on all over the place. But if you make it into a rainbow, it actually looks way neater. And not only that, but I thought it would be really hard to find each book, but actually I can find my books quicker because I know what the front cover looks like. So I know what the spine is generally colored like, and then I can just look for that color in the shelf and I find it even quicker. So yeah, it's really fast, really easy. I love, love, love it. You can also arrange your books in different rooms according to different colors and it will be really fun and you'll feel really happy. And what's better than that? So that is my video. I hope you've enjoyed seeing my rainbow shelves. I think they look amazing. I'm really proud of them. <laughs> I encourage you to do the same thing. If you do do it, let me know. I'm at Labels for Lunch on Instagram and Twitter and pretty much everywhere. And I'd love to see pictures. I'd love to see how you do yours. Thank you very much for watching. Hopefully I'll see you again soon. Goodbye. <laughs>